Hey kids! Have you ever looked at the mirror and wondered how you were able to see yourself? Or how about when you sit down to eat dinner? Have you ever wondered how you are able to smell the delicious food that your mom has cooked for you? You can see yourself and smell the food on your plate because of your senses. Your senses are your body's way of learning about the world. How? It helps you feel your surroundings. And you know what else? Seeing and smelling aren't your only senses. You also have ears to hear, your tongue to taste, and skin to touch. Seeing, hearing, smelling, tasting, and touching are senses. Your eyes, nose, ears, tongue, and skin, on the other hand, are your body parts that let you use your senses. All in all, you have five senses and five organs to help you with those senses. What are those five body parts and five senses again? Your eyes to see, your ears to hear, your nose to smell, your tongue to taste, and your skin to touch. What is amazing about our senses is that even if we think we're not using them, they're still working. For example, you're walking down a sidewalk. All of a sudden, someone yells in surprise because they accidentally dropped their burger. When that person yelled, you turned to him in surprise. Why? Because even if you're not really listening to anything while you were walking, your ears were still working. And they were able to quickly pick up the sound of the yell. That's also one good use of senses. They help us become alert of our surroundings. Our eyes have many parts. These are the eyebrows. When our faces make expressions, our eyebrows make our happy faces even more happier, especially our surprise faces. These are the eyelids. It is like the cover for our eyes. It helps keep our eyes clean. Whenever it closes, it cleans out the eyes like wipers on a car window. It cleans out any dust or dirt. These small hairs here are called eyelashes. They help the eyelids brush the dirt out of the eyes. Our ears help us hear. They collect sounds that reach us. The ear, like the eye and the other senses, have smaller parts that help make it work. The outer ear is everything we can see. It's the one that catches and collects the sounds around us. The inner ear has tiny nerves to help us feel. And since it is connected to the inside of our head, it also has the liquid that helps protect our brains. We can't see this part anymore. The eardrum is extra special. It is inside our ears. It vibrates when the sound comes in and sends them to our brains. We can smell because of our nose. It can tell us if it smells good or bad. The holes in our noses are called nostrils. The smell enters through them and travels through what is called the nasal passage, a hallway inside the nose. The nasal cavity is a small space behind your nose. It's the end of the hallway of the inside of your nose. The tongue lets us taste different kinds of food, but it also helps in chewing and swallowing our food. The tongue has nerves that send the taste we get from food to the brain. Then the brain will know whether we are eating something hot, cold, sweet, bitter, sour, or salty. Lastly, our skin can feel things. It can feel the temperature or whether something is cold or hot, the texture of an object, if it feels smooth, soft, or rough, how heavy or light something is, and whether or not something is causing us pain. Like all the others, our skin has parts that help make it work. It has nerves that help us with the feeling. It also has hair that can protect us from the cold, and pores that help us sweat so we can cool down when we get exhausted. Our skin can also come in different colors, all of them beautiful.
To recap, we have five senses that help us learn the world around us. We also have five body parts that allow for our senses to work. These are our eyes for seeing, our nose for smelling, our ears for hearing, our tongue for tasting, and our skin for feeling. Each body part has its own smaller parts that help make them work the way they do. Amazing, right? All of our senses work together so that we can experience the beautiful world around us. It's quiz time! Which sense do we use when we want to do these activities? Hug something soft. Yes! We use our skin to feel the soft teddy bear as we hug it when we sleep. Read a book. Correct! We use our eyes to read the words written on the pages. Eat delicious food. Awesome! We use our tongue to taste the wonderful meal mom cooked for us. Hear pleasant music. Right! We use our ears to hear the wonderful music playing. Smell the ocean air. Amazing! We use our nose to smell the nice ocean air whenever we're at the beach. Like this video and click the subscribe and bell buttons below for more TPK Learning videos. If you have any thoughts about today's topic, leave us a comment below.